my name is uh, Fred Adam. I love hammocking. I discovered this uh, great uh, tool and practice when I met uh, Rich Blendel in 2014. I am part of the OIKA project and uh, I am especially interested uh, in a rich uh, creative uh, view and ideas uh, because uh, it connects deeply uh, into my uh, professional uh, practice which is uh, audiovisual creation with mobile technology and uh, I believe that we, we have a big mess today with, uh, with technology because uh, we need to, to review what it means to be connected, uh, what it means uh, to, be, to use uh, mobile devices and what it means to communicate. And uh, I can see around me that uh, we have generally a bad use. We do a bad use of, of technology and technology uh, the paradox is that technology disconnects us from nature, from the environment, from the physical place. And we need, uh, from, from, from art, uh, which is my, uh, my interest, to explore uh, how to reverse this use and uh, get advantage of this amazing technology to improve our senses sometimes and uh, capture the essence of our interaction with nature and reflect also to the to the world to the society uh, a deeper sense of connection and communication it's a big challenge because I believe that right now we are in front of an epidemic of disconnection. And it's not about saying, hey, you no, know, I don't want to use technology. No, we have to get advantage of this technology. But of course, it's not about uh, using technology every time. Just sometimes, when we have spent a good time in nature, uh, it's interesting to use a, an audio recording or a video recording, capture images, uh, to tell stories. Stories happening uh, in a natural way, emerging. You know? It's not about uh, uh, planning a script and recording a story we want. No, it's stories are around us, they pop up naturally. And this is this idea, no? To just being open to what's going on and capture a, a beautiful moment of connection and reflect it to the world and to the internet also. Then that's why I'm here, because I practice deeply what we call Earth stories. And uh, I experience a lot of different practices regarding sounds, images, and uh, I am now uh, available for you to, to share some uh, very simple uh, practices and uh, help you to tell her stories your way, of course, no? because uh, each place is unique, each person is unique, each insect is unique, each bird is unique, each, each tree is unique, each story is unique. And beautiful. All right. Let's speak soon. I am around whenever you want.